Hello everyone, it's Craig here from Upside Down Shark, and I'm joined by Francesco, yeah. one of the developers from Guntastic. Exactly. Tell us about it, what is it? Okay, so Guntastic is a 2D couch and online multiplayer shooter. Uh, we're up to four players battling very fast, one shot, one kill matches. So it's, uh, it's a party game, but with an arcade competitive kind of twist. Uh, so the game blends uh, very fast gunfights uh, and uh, an over-the-top pixelated graphic style uh, and the retro soundtrack, uh, which are reminiscent of uh, the 16-bit games of the late 90s. Uh, we tried to build a game which was very easy to pick up, so um, newcomers will learn how to play in uh, just a couple of rounds, yeah. uh, but still it, we wanted to, to have a game with enough depth to keep players interested in the long run. Yeah. Um, and we tried to build that complexity uh, in the weapons and the power-ups and the levels themselves. It's one of those things where it's easy to <coughs> just pick up and play, but, Ex exactly. but it takes a while to master. Exactly, yeah. exactly, yeah. Uh, I mean, we only have, you only have to learn three buttons, literally, literally and, but still, uh, it, it takes a, a while to really master so all the weapons and the power-ups and the levels themselves uh, that has got dynamic elements uh, yeah. which players can activate to frag their opponents in uh, spectacular ways. Yeah, so it's not just weapons you pick up, there's environmental depth as well, like there's a lift with razor blades exactly. and you can activate a train to just <coughs> demolize them. Just beat everyone. <laughs> exactly, exactly, um, yeah. What was one of your influences for this game? Because obviously you say it's got that, that retro style, that yeah. retro look. Yeah, well, the, the gunfights uh, uh, are inspired by um, Metal Slug, mostly. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. And the round-based oh. gameplay is inspired by more recent games such as Towerfall Ascension and oh, yes. uh, Move or Die, for example. Uh, <coughs> so we have uh, these very fast uh, rounds, uh, which only last 25 seconds, yes. after which everyone who's still alive is forcibly killed. <laughs> so players have to be very, very quick. <laughs> Oh, that sounds good, that sounds good. Um, so, with Towerfall being, uh, that's the first thing I thought of when I saw it. Okay. What made you think, this is the outline, let's, let's, let's put our own phase on top of it, our own spin. Mm. What, what made you go from the bow and arrows to over yeah. the top guns, yeah. just Chaos. Uh -huh. Well, we, we've been avid players of Metal Slug since we were young mm -hmm. and we wanted to, and also we're also a fan of uh, shooter games such as the old Unreal Tournament series, uh, Quake and so on, so we wanted to have these kind, that kind of gameplay yep. built into the game, uh, but at the same time we wanted to build something which was accessible for players of all ages, etc. So that that's why we try to build uh, a game which plays uh, very fast, but still uh, it gets manageable thanks to the 25 second rounds. So you, you have uh, some time to pause uh, between rounds, and so you're ready for the next one. Yeah. Uh, four players, you say, yes. Uh, yes, from yep. two to four players. Two to four players. Yeah. So no, no single player at all now? Uh, not for now. Not for now? Uh, yeah, it's... Um, I mean, the, um, we, we thought about having maybe an artificial intelligence, but it's yeah. not something we, we really could develop until now. We're a very small team, we're only two developers, so it, yeah, building... You're half of the development team, right Ex here. Exactly, yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> yeah. You built it in mind for just partying, so just like, bring your friends along, let's have a good time. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Um, one more question sure. before we go. How much blood is too much blood? Uh, <coughs> is there going to be a blood slider? Like, more to less? Because there's quite well, a lot already. Like, let's just pump it up to yeah. more. Well, you know, it, we, we wanted, I mean, Gantastic, it can be a violent game, but we try to have a very comedic violence, yes. so it's so kind of exaggerated. Yeah, there was a zombie, there was a monkey, there was yeah. a nudist. Yeah, yeah, it's a kind of crazy. Yeah, <laughs> we, with the characters, we didn't want to have a strong common theme when we started developing them, so yeah. that's why, yeah, that's how you end up having a naked guy next to a zombie. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Exactly. I, I go for the deep lore of Guntastic, that's okay. what I'm there for. Okay, <laughs> okay. Um, well, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you very much if for I having me. Check out Guntastic. Thanks. Um, check out Guntastic in the future.